you admit to each and every element of the offense of falsifying physical evidence and abuse of corpse. Is that yes. accurate? Okay. And did you yes. did you speak with your lawyers in detail about that? Yes, I did. And uh, have you reviewed the opening statement in which they will tell that to the jurors? Yes, I did. And um, do you wish for them to acknowledge your guilt on both of those charges, falsifying physical evidence and abuse of corpse? Yes. And do you understand that it would be the state's obligation to prove each and every element of those offenses beyond a reasonable doubt before the jury could find you guilty? Do you understand that? Yes. And that by uh, agreeing to allow them to acknowledge this in opening statements, uh, the, the jurors can find you guilty of those two offenses uh, relying yes. on that information. Do you understand that? Yes. Okay, and that is what you wish to do? Yes, ma'am. Okay, do you have any further question about that? No, I do not. All right, uh, anything further that the state requests? Nothing is further the state request. We would assume that the court would take that into account and make a decision whether or not he's making a knowing, intelligent, voluntary waiver of uh, essentially proof of his facts and proceeding this way, which I'm sure the court will do. Okay, um, so anything you want to add, Attorney Smith? Not on that issue. Okay. So, uh, Mr. Montgomery, having heard from you that you've discussed this with your lawyers, that you've reviewed the opening statements, uh, the draft of the opening statement, that you acknowledge that you understand that the burden of proof is on the state to prove uh, each of those offenses beyond a reasonable doubt, and that it, understanding uh, that it is your desire for them to proceed with that strategy. The court does find that this is a knowing, intelligent, and voluntary waiver uh, of your rights and will allow them to proceed on that basis, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay, um, so uh, while I have you, um, today you did refuse transport, so I want to talk to you about tomorrow. As we discussed with you this morning, you can't change your mind midway through the day, uh, but you can inform the court if you wish to come tomorrow uh, and what I would like to do and each day thereafter. So you can come and we will send a transport for you. That is your absolute right. Uh, but as I explained to you this morning, it's also your right uh, to, to waive your presence and for us to proceed in your absence. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna instruct the Sheriff's Office and the Department of Corrections that someone will ask you tomorrow morning, do you wish to come to court today? Uh, we will have transport available to you if you want to come, but I am not inclined to send a car up there to pick you up only to have you refuse. Um, so do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. Okay, do you have any concern about that procedure? No, I do not. Okay. Um, so it is our intention to have someone ask you tomorrow morning whether or not you wish to come. And whenever they come to ask you that question, they're going to need an answer from you uh, so that we have sufficient time to make sure that we uh, get you down here in order for us to start the trial in a timely manner. Do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, and I believe your your counsel will be speaking to you later at some point later today. Not today. Oh, not today. Okay. okay. Um, okay, um, so uh, that's going to be the procedure for tomorrow morning and each day thereafter of this trial, unless and until the court makes a different order on that. Do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, is there anything further from the state while Mr. Montgomery is present? No, Your Honor. Okay. Thank you. Anything further from the defense? No, Your Honor. All right. Mr. Yeah. Montgomery, uh, you're free to go now. I appreciate that. So he pled the Guilty to two of the charges of falsifying ev evidence and abuse to a corpse. Let's see what happens tomorrow during court. And let's see if he refuses transport. I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update of what happened in court today. I think that is the most important thing that he pled guilty to two of the charges. So tomorrow I might go live, I'm not sure. It depends on what happens in court, but I wanna do a discussion 
Um, it either will be tomorrow night or Friday night. So I will see you guys soon. I love you all, and thank you for subscribing and hitting the like button. Let's keep Harmony's name out there, and let's get her justice. 